Hello everybody, today I'm going to show you this Abaco BR40 floodlight bulb. This one is 150 watts, so this is a really old one. <clears throat> of course, as you can tell, got a restore for 35 cents, really good deal. Um, pick this one up because it's really unique. Um, it's 150 watt. Now, these were only around for a while, and then they converted to 120 watt, which, as you've seen in the past couple of years, fade away. I do believe you can still find the 120 watt bulbs in a rough service coating at Walmart, but I, I'm not really sure. Anyway, this is very nice, rare, interesting 150 watt floodlight bulbs. So here's the front of the package, of course, as you've seen. On the side, like I've said before, I really like how they put these pictures in here. See the design of the houses when this bulb was manufactured. The back of the package, some little spots. Somebody must have had it sitting in their garage or basement or something. Some more information. The front again. Oh, 1995, the year I was born. That's really nice. Made in Taiwan. It seems like I've had, or I have, um, almost every single Abaco floodlight bulb. I have like every single size. It's pretty interesting. But anyway, we open up the package, and there's this thing to keep the bulb upright. So here's the bulb itself. You'll notice right off the bat that the bulge right here, um, is bigger than normal. That is because, of course, it has a 150 watt filament. Let's see, let me look inside the bulb here. You can't see it on camera. You kind of have to look at a weird angle. It kind of looks like the filament kind of is in a, a um, pointed shape. Well, not really. You Anyway, it's at a shape like that is what the filament is in. So there's one support in the middle. Um, it's a very nice blue insulator on the bottom. And we see Abaco, 120 volt, 150 watt Taiwan. Um, has a very nice heat shield there. Well, there, you can kind of see the filament in there. You kind of see it? I hope you can see it. I think you understand what I'm talking about. But anyway, very nice front. It's a very nice bulb. I'm happy to have this one in my collection. So... Let's screw this big guy in. And boy is he bright. He means business. Look at that. Now that's called lighting it up. Very nice. There, it's lighting up its own box. How fancy. Anyway, there's the bulb itself. You can kind of see some light is filtering out through the back here, but you got to remember it's a pretty bright filament in there. You have a 150 watts. So, it definitely is brighter than the 120 watt version. So, it's quite a unique bulb for 150 watt. Yes, they make an outdoor version, but as you know, that is totally different. It doesn't have the... It's an outdoor type. But anyway, very nice, very decent, happy to have it. Hope you enjoyed this video of my Abaco 150 watt, oh it says recessed, floodlight bulb. Also please comment, rate, and subscribe. Thank you.